Okay, so someone just requested uh, wait tutorial. As you can see here, here's a few of my uh, very very crude but uh, preview animation. There I have, this is the work that someone contacted me about. And I'm sorry about the audio quality already because my headset broke and uh, I'm recording with my phone. So, uh, what we are going to do, I'm going to simplify this uh, quite a lot because I want to make this fast because I don't have uh, a much time to make this right now. I'm going to show you, here is a uh, Here is the weights on the character, and as you can see, they are they are just how it works is the if you have a knee, then from knee to angle, you paint the partition, and uh, if you have from angle to middle of the feet, then you paint that partition and then from uh, middle of the feet to the tip of your toes you paint that joint and uh, after, after that is done you will smooth the weights together and I'm going to show you how that's done with uh, and this is everything uh, do this before you animate, because as I'm showing here, uh, this is already animated character. You can change the weights when it's animated, but it's very hard to do. Uh, well, animating after uh, before the weights have been corrected, because as you can see, the mesh just breaks when you delete the uh, weights. Of course, you can overrun by other other joints' weight. So, but it is easier to create a crude weight construct before starting to animate. <coughs> Here you can see now is the it's just a cylinder that I made, and I'm going to create uh, just two two points of rotation with three joints and showing you the weights the weights are uh, okay now they are turning a bit rough but that's just because there aren't enough polygons on the rotating parts but if you sub subdivide it uh, now you can see it's completely broke because uh, every other mesh. Uh, every other polygon is just weighted and every other no is not. So what we are going to do is, this is basically you think this like an arm and uh, here I paint first joint, paint, paint, to the, from, paint the whole area of the first joint, second joint, same job, third joint same job and now it rotates as it did before but there's that huge edge still what you do is select smooth uh, just check my weight tool settings uh, st strength and uh, hardness I always recommend at 100 when you're just doing the crude weighting uh, when you're starting to smooth Turn the strength down. Now it's quite huge still. I, I recommend like 10 or 15 and just spray all over it. As you can now see, the weights have been smoothed out. And if this were an arm, the rotation would be quite good. It would lift the skin over. Uh, what I'm gonna say? Bend the skin over. The arm for. I hope this helped a lot. Uh, 
this is the way I have been creating, uh, for example, a third-person platformer game that I've been made, making, and um, here's just a small example. These are I'm going to show you the weights, and you can see how it's blended. The dark and uh, <coughs> the more the weight. A painted weight darkens. It means it's going to the the other joint is taking over. Also, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Or if if this really helped, if you have more questions, please f feel free to ask, and uh, I'll try to make uh, something out of it and uh, help you out. Thank you for watching.